I'll be in on the right. As the spring semester starts to come to a close, a lot of work is going on behind the scenes. Residence hall staffs have a lot of work to do to prepare both the residence and the building for the end of the semester. Yes. <laughs> focused. This puts a lot of stress on the residence hall personnel as they must hold floor meetings, put up bulletin boards, and conduct checkouts, all while studying and taking exams for their own classes. That puts on a lot of stress just because um, it does require a lot of time, it does make you wake up earlier. In Jim Cummings Hall, there are roughly 350 residents and only 8 housing staff members, which equals out to about 44 students per housing staff member. Residence hall staff members need to manage their time a lot more closely than during the rest of the semester. We normally would work, what, like 25 hours a week? I would say that we double that. I mean, we really don't stop working during closing. In areas like Cummings, the area coordinators have gone out of their way to make life a lot easier on the resident assistants by making packets like these ones that overview all of the things that need to be done before the building is to be closed for the summer. Resident assistant Damien Black has this piece of advice for on-campus residents during closing. Please pay attention to your floor meetings and to the signs that are put on their bulletin boards. Liam Watt, MT10.